<laughs> All right, so horrible decision. I do want to talk about if you guys watch Bonding, if you guys are into BDSM, we've brought up mad regular vanilla fucking floggers, paddles, basic shit. We just brought up the chastity uh, belt. Chastity devices, yeah. Uh, the chastity devices. That's not that basic. But I, It's not that basic. It's a little hard mm -hmm. to find. I want to ask you, what is the most expensive contraption that you have at your studio um, that you've either rented out and had to teach people? Like, what's the most expensive sex toy you have? One of the most expensive things is actually a chastity device. Really? I was going to say the Sibian ride I thought would be. I, no, I don't, I don't have one of those. Oh, okay. What is but it? Uh, the Sibian, oh. it's a, it's a female masturbation machine. So oh, it's basically it's like a saddle. See. And so you sit on it oh. and it vibrates. Or it makes your whole pussy things. just yes, open up. Cause I couldn't exactly. imagine. That doesn't yeah. make sense to me, but but the chassis cage that I have, can I say who makes it or where it's from? Yeah, okay. So um, the hey, y'all, your ad can go here too. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it like the from the olden days? Just no, 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 no. These are custom made uh -oh. in Canada by a company That's called extreme. Steelworks. Steelworks Extreme, I think it is, and Steelworks. it's W E R K S. Okay. And um, and it is a four thousand dollar cat chassis cage. It is made out of titanium. And he, but he's made ones that were twenty thousand dollars. Twenty thousand dollars people spend. <laughs> she said, "Why to lock? Genuinely, their dick like up. why? Why do they spend where, where that does money? The cost uh, come from? Come from? Yeah. Um, because it's made out of titanium. Because of the, because these are like custom made and and custom however made. intricate. Yeah, they. I mean, these are the locks. bespoke. So however intricate, they'll they'll be kinds that have like. Um, your urethral pl plugs that go in that you know have containers titanium your like catheters, catheters? You, yeah basically um, so because you wear it full time and so it's so that way you can still urinate N oh they I thought you didn't have urinate. catheters put in the I just thought you had a hold um, it's a showing us it's a short oh. it's a short there you go so that's, that's actually really so that's looking. yeah that's a that's that one's called like the Shonda mask Shonda mask I think or that's a crucible okay um Oh, but something like that alchemist is going to be so it it goes around the balls too yes and you know what is that a fucking clock it's a steampunk steam yeah so wow. see if you see one that's called like the creature i think oh, well, oh there the goes fuck right do you there. do their goddamn website too you know everything yeah, you have this one right so no uh i don't have that one that looks cool I I have two. I the have exoskeleton. A... Cage the Beast. Yeah. Ooh, I'm gonna start calling we... Dick's Beast, bitch. I like that. <laughs> you don't like that. But no the beauty. but the idea is that they <laughs> so they're custom made. They're made for long term wear. They're mm -hmm. people who wear theirs twenty four seven to work. Three sixty five. I I pulled up you really know? quick the history of chastity belts. Ooh. Does anyone have a guess of uh the year? Probably the eighteen hundred. I would yeah. say more like sixteen hundred. Eighteen hundreds. No, um, before that. 16, 1700. 1150. Oh, yeah. That'd be before Christ. I think so. But it's not, <laughs> it says it's not clear. Um, they Some believe they were made in the 14th century in Italy, but other references have the similar device used mm -hmm. in the Crusades, Roman and Greek times, and 11 BC. In Paris, women were forced to wear iron chastity belts. One version had an iron hoop covered with velvet, um, and the hoop had notches so the man could tighten and loosen it depending on his mood. Yeah. Chastity belts were often made in only one side. Larger women were forced to wear them and suffer the pain no matter the fit. Um, in the 16th and 17th centuries, a popular belt in Europe included an iron girdle, which mm -hmm. had a circumference of 32 inches. The a area surrounding the hips, basically, you'd put it on like um, underwear. Like almost. a panty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's... And that's, small so those are for your, women. That, yeah. but, and what's crazy is not until this show started and I started like learning mm -hmm. things, even you, you like all of your devices, I have no idea who, how, where they come from. And when we think of chastity devices, we do. We think of like a lock and key panty for a woman. Right. And so the idea is like... The cage that, was the one they were talking about during the Crusades. For, was for women, sorry. Yeah. Ah, yeah, all so of that's yeah. Most of the chassis devices started out for women, and mm. then eventually it became for men, and it was to, you know, just prevent them from masturbation or prevent them from. What would be, in your opinion, your kinkiest sex toy? If that's like, like one that you're like, okay. after we just saw one called the steampunk. <laughs> I mean, I think that it gets kinkier than a chastity belt. Like, I mean, I, I was like, it? like even if you see bonding, there's a contraption where someone is uh, levitated in a completely leather mask and right. Oh, um, so suspended. the suspension, suspended, yeah. yeah. So that, so that's, that's what a I suspension. Say, levitated, so levitated. 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 It works. So it's one the of the thing, things right? that happens in, in in season two of bonding is there's a scene, there's a breath play scene, yes, in which someone is Great. in a sleep sack, which is. Um, 
it's like a sleeping bag that so faces have up. And and so and he has a gas mask on and there's a hose that goes from the gas mask to a bottle and it's called a bubbler bottle. Bubbler. A bubbler bottle. And the bubbler bottle basically is like a bong where air gets filtered through whatever fluid is in the bottle. Uh, does it look like this? Uh, that's what the sleep sack kind of looks like, but you should probably Google like leather, leather sleep sack. My first time seeing a sleep sack was a uh, real sex when I was a kid. Yeah. Oh, wow. I'm not going to lie. This is, no. yes, this no. is, this is the, the mm -hmm. to me, that is pretty kinky. Yes. I'm not going to lie. So, and I know we talk about breath pay, play with fucking pillowcases and right. a man putting his hand on your neck, but this right. is an extensive. Mm. Yes. Yeah. So what happens, so what happens in the bonding scene is there's, so he is in what's called full sensory deprivation. So he's listening. I'm he's listening to Brahms. I to, so sensory deprivation is when um, it's the depriving of the senses. So you're blindfolded. It's a form of sensory right. deprivation. If you have a gag in your mouth, we it's a form we've of sensory deprivation. Like a few days ago too, um, uh, if you are, you know, hooded so that you can't hear, your ears are plugged. That's also sensory deprivation. Um, so, so. And he can't move either. So he's like fully immobilized in the sleep sack and his breath is being controlled by this bubbler bottle. And now, every breath gets filtered through the fluid that's in the bu bu bubbler bottle. Do they, wow. do they come? So that's pretty freaky. Do they after come in or before or in it or do they just? Oh, good question. Yeah. Do they come inside of that? Um, oh, wow. it, I think it, you know, it all depends on the Dom. Um, okay. But, but for many Honestly, have you ever done the um, flotation tanks? The no, the, girl, yet, I ain't I never do none of this. No, no, no. Oh, this that is, ain't sex. No, 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 it's not. not. What is a it's flotation tank? Does it? It's like a therapy. Thing. Yeah, it's it's a therapeutic thing. So uh -oh. it's like you go. It's a. It's basically like a salt. It's like a tub. Salt tub. Salt and they water encapsulate tub. Encapsulate you in it. Right. And it's dark. Yes. And, and so you, you float. Forward. So it's weightlessness. Oh, um, so it's also kind of similar that to like just science, and I ain't to just like being in a in a hammock. And so okay. you know, how, like the, the the feeling of being in a hammock when you're just sort of like hanging. Just, your mom's sack. You know. No, that's not it. No, no, no. All right. Um, <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. What he's uh, I was thinking of normal. Oh right. my god! Like, look it up. This not quite like that. If you look up a uh, flota uh, flotation tank. Flotation tank. <laughs> flotation tank. Y'all, y'all can't can see. see can the they screen. see this on the screen? I mean, they, they could, they but can. if you want to embarrass me, I was looking up <laughs> flotation devices. <laughs> 